Call the DJ, turn it up. Better DJ, bring it back. Tell him, play that shit again. Tell him, turn up the bass. Turn it up. Better DJ, bring it back. Call the DJ, turn it up. What's up Goonies, Claire Jagoon here, and guys, in today's PUBG Mobile video, I got a special treat for you guys, and it is made possible by a friend and fellow Goonie, Mr. Ja Solo Gaming. And guys, he has gave me the ability to do a lot uh, in this video, and you'll see that. So with that being said, let's get into the video. Okay guys, in typical Ja Solo fashion, and this video is dedicated to him, so I played a solo mission. Uh, thus his name, Ja Solo. Uh, so right here, as you see, guys, um, I've got a new suit. Uh, Papa's got a brand new bag in this video. I've got some new guns, some new skins, and uh, some exciting kill effects. So that's that's all in store in this video, and all thanks to Ja Solo. And thank you so much, amigo, for that. Uh, right here, guys, I'm in Pachinki in payload mode, my favorite mode, and um, I am surrounded. I'm literally surrounded. And so when you're playing solo squads in in this particular mode especially, it's very dangerous when you're when you don't really know where your enemies are per se. Um, and right now I'm just launching RPGs into that house. I heard a guy there. I know he's in those rooms. I'm just not getting the right spot. But eventually look, he goes out. I get a knock right there. Beautiful. Now I'm gonna continue watching that knock. And wait for his teammate to come out and his teammate will come out trust me because he's calling to him he's like bro help me help me bro and it's gonna happen now unfortunately there's no kill effects for rpgs that kind of sucks i'd like that and guys make sure if you have not subscribed to clerk jagoon gaming hit that subscribe button definitely hit the like button and i want to see you in my comments and right here there went his guy that went after the uh, revive. I took him down. He's dead. Still got one uh, crawling around there, but now I've got a confirmed kill. I've tasted blood. I'm ready to go. There's another one of his teammates across from me. I'm going to launch some RPGs in that house, soften him up a little bit, and then I'm going to move out and fly. Yeah, right here. I'm going to go. I'm going to get out of here. I'm going to flank. I'm not getting any, any progress there. So... I'm going to switch to my weapon for close quarter combat. And I'm going wide flank, guys, because I don't know if I've got a guy in that house right there. You, you just And i just seen a guy right there, a flash of him. I don't know if you guys seen him, but there is a guy in the field. There's a guy on the roof of that house. Um, I, did, I don't think I've seen him at this point, but I see him here. And I'm like, oh, crap, there's a guy up there. So I'm trying to get a, I'm trying to get a bead on him right now. So right there, he shot an RPG behind me in that corner. I would have died if I would have tried to hug a corner. You cannot hug corners. Uh, if you don't believe me, I'll show you later in this video why you don't. And right here, I'm just going to reset the battle. He knows where approximately I was. So I couldn't go up into that building on those uh, balconies because he would RPG me. So right here, I'm trying to get a shot on him. Can't do it right now, but the opportunity will present itself in a minute. And now I've got more activity on the other side of me. Pachinki's hot, baby. Also in this game mode, when you're playing solo, I tend to I tend to get a little paranoid. Um, I don't know about you guys. Right here, there's the opportunity. I've got it. Boom. Let it loose. Got him. He's down. Can't try to finish. Can't get him. There's a guy dead right there to the left. I've seen that. I'm going to watch his teammate go over to revive. There he is. Always happens, guys. Play the knocks. Play the knocks. He's coming for this guy, but guess what? This guy knows he's dead now. He does he try to move. I don't even know. Did you see the swimming pool in the crate? That's beautiful, man. Beautiful. Now watch this, guys. Remember what I said about playing the corner. That guy's obviously on that corner. I've seen him cross there. He hasn't come out. I know he's there. Well, I'm fixing to send him a present. Good night. He's dead, but I hear somebody else. Uh, so I'm just going to knock another RPG off in that corner just in case. I didn't get anybody. And I'm going to start to displace because I've gotten stagnant. Once you stay in an area, and now I hear somebody in the houses over there, you need to move. Uh, I've shot a couple of times. I've announced my position in that area. 
now I need to move. So right here, I'm just going to watch for a second to see if I can pick up any activity in these houses. I do hear them. There are people there, but they're not exposing themselves. Yeah. Don't think naughty either. Not that kind of exposure. So I've got some shots here. Um, I think a helicopter took off. Yep, helicopter took off. So people shot at it. It was obviously a bot in there, but obviously another one sounded real. So now I'm gonna press up to the shots and uh, see if I can eliminate. That's real. That's definitely real. And I'm moving through the houses, guys, because I don't know how safe I am on the flanks. I'm just kind of paranoid at this point. I know that I'm outnumbered and I'm gonna hold this wall because I've got sound. This is kind of, I did a, a video on Pachinki defensive strategies and this is kind of one of the strategies when you're outnumbered, you need to, to make a choke point and, and this particular area is a choke point. Now I also made a video on how to, how to bust up these defensive strategies. So. There's a counter strategy to that strategy. Obviously, you can you can go on a rooftop and come in behind me, but a lot of people they don't watch my videos, so they don't know. That's the way it is. There we go. There's the choke point. I'll thirst him up right quick. I'm gonna grab some ammo and stuff. <clears throat> Pretty soon, I'm gonna loot him. Trust me. hear all those people like they're everywhere it's like ants like I when I get like this um, you know I don't know exactly which area is safe um, safe way to egress out of a building I get kind of paranoid and I start kind of slowing down a little bit and right there you see this guy's head watch this WTF bro like that was an RPG to that guy's head what happened what happened got him right there um, and now he's down so I'm going to rush him because I know his teammate is going to go to him and try to revive him. And look, this guy's clueless. He doesn't even see me. He's going to turn around here in a second, but by then it's too late. I'm spraying. Get out of here. Head back to the airport, bro. Watch Claret Jagoon Gaming. Get some hints, amigo. He should have held the wall. Now, I still would have RPG'd him, though, but he should have held that wall. But right here, guys, I dried out Pachinki and decided to take, a, take the helicopter and get out. And guys... I got into a fight right here, let me tell you, the kind of fights that I love. Um, where, you know, I'm outnumbered, obviously, just like in Pachinki, uh, but we've got some range here, and we're going to start exchanging. Um, I'm going to get my helicopter to a safe area. I added a little music, guys. For, for whatever reason, um, the audio was not clean in this video, and, and so I had to add a little bit of music. My apologies for that. That's not my normal MO. But hey, some of you guys might like it. Might mess up my monetization. I don't know yet. Let's see. Right here, I'm just peppering up the helicopter, and then I notice the guy come down. So I'm, and he's noob tubing me, which is the dumbest thing ever. But I'm spraying right here, trying to find him. I got some hit markers around in there. I, I don't really see him. I'm just kind of reaching out and seeing if I can get him. Right there, I've got a teammate of his putting fire on me, and now I've got somebody in the three stack. That guy's putting either a, a, a 5.56 weapon in single or he is got a mini 14. But right here, this guy is dumb. He's out in the open. I'm going to pop up, knock him, and get back under cover. Um, I talk about this in one of my videos about how to play heels and berms. This is exactly what you do. You pop up just for a minute, go back down. Right here, I miss every shot. Potato, potato. Trying to revive. Got him too. GG. Still got this guy right here. He's a he's a persistent little bugger, isn't he? There's another uh, teammate trying to get his card. I can't get him. And this I'm gonna get this guy. He's gonna make a mistake right here. He does almost hit me. You know, he committed to the shot. He got dropped. 
That's all right. I, I like that. I like when when people actually play aggressively. Um, I hate when people just camp corners and wait for you to walk past them. So hey, that's off to him. Did good. Now right now you're not really seeing these kill effects quite, uh, quite as much. Look at that, beautiful. And I even shoot this because I don't know what it is. I'm not used to kill effects, guys, so. I'm a noob to kill effects. Yeah, I, I'm telling you, it's it's mind blowing. So right here, um, rather than go up there and try to loot those guys, I elected to uh, play it safe. I'd had not enough information uh, if I had, you know, because that guy was knocked. I knew there was still a player out there. Um, I didn't want to just roll up there out in the open like that guy tried to approach me over here on this uh, open area to the right. Um, I didn't want to be a dum dum, and so I didn't. So I elected to fall back. But in doing so, I, I wasn't able to properly loot um, after that fight. That was a big fight. I did a lot of sprays with my 5.56 weapon. And right here, the guy that's the last member of that squad, he tries to bug out. So the helicopter comes into play. I'm gonna go hide. There's at least I don't know how many's there, but I think if I'm not mistaken, there could be two. But I only seen one, and he was out on the uh, the wing of the helicopter. Now I'm gonna test this guy right here, and I find out it's good. Unfortunately, the Open Elite Creator uh, sign down there is in the way of my help. But guys, this guy put a hurt on me, so that let me know I'm dealing with a serious competitor here. So he's gonna push me too, which. I don't know what his name is right now, but hats off to him um, because this guy plays like me, and I like that. So right here, I'm smoking my helicopter. I, I want to, uh, I want to get to my helicopter, and I was just trying to smoke his vision. Um, but he decided to flank me, and I said, you know what? I'm not running from this fight. This video is dedicated to Ja Solo, and I was like, we're gonna fight for Ja right here. There he is. He's going around. Good spray, though. A little drop down, and now I'm flanking. Now, me and this guy's going to go toe to toe, and somebody's going to. What me today, baby? The AK takes it for the win. Hey, good job to you, though, bro. Whatever your name is here. I think it's Jose Augustine 821. Good job, bro. That was an excellent fight. Hats off to you for taking it. Now here comes that guy that was cowardly hanging out over there while we were engaging. Um, and he's trying to RPG me. He ain't going to get me, bro. And here's the thing. With this particular engagement, I elect to just leave this guy. I'm going to I'm gonna met up because, hey, Jay Augustine or whatever his name was, he, he put a hurting on me. He did. Good job, bro. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to met up. And at this point, this guy here is probably dead. Zone's coming in. And I just said, you know what? Heck with him. I'm getting out of here. I'm going to go. I run from this fight. Sorry, guys. Made sense. And right here, I run into a helicopter. Of course, they're going to shoot at me because they actually got people on the, on the wings of the helicopter, so to speak, shooting. So I've got a squad. And I've got to get this helicopter down because I have no way to shoot it. So I see this compound right here, and I'm hoping this compound is empty. And I'm just going to land this bird, and get out, and I'm going to start shooting these guys. But I'm first, I'm going to get the high ground. That's what you need. To, and, and guys, a lot of times in these situations, it always has to be instantaneous um, with your thoughts right here. See, I see them. They landed. And I just run upstairs, get the high ground, and I'm going to start laying into these guys. This guy's close. Yep, there we go. Now I'm scared of the wall behind me because this one guy shoots an RPG. Try to knock, try to knock this guy. Then I, that, my button changed, guys. I've changed my buttons a million times. Um, and that caused me to go into my map. Right here, this guy was aiming at me. Boom, he almost got me. Almost got me. That could have that could have been bad. I'm going to finish off this guy right here because I have 
there he goes. Nice kill effect. Now these guys are probably reviving. He's down, and now I've got one more left in the squad. I'm gonna flank around because he's not suspecting, and guess what, guys? Easy fight. There you go, movement, shoot and move. Now listen. Helicopter. I mean, people are everywhere, guys. There's there's um, nine players left. Look at these kill effects. Thank you so much, John, man. This is so awesome. Like, like I couldn't believe I was shooting the chest earlier, man. Here's the last few guys. Um, I'm going to take these guys down. Well, no. No, let me just let me take that back. I took this one guy down, and I'm going to go finish him right here. And I almost died. This guy gets me with the BSS right here. Whoa. He almost killed me. Now watch this move, guys. I put a move on this guy. I don't have any grenades, but I, I threw a smoke to make him think I had a grenade. And then I'm gonna I'm gonna put this AK on him. Because the AK is uh, it's very effective. But watch this watch this engagement. And I had a WTF. WTF fuck you mother. What happened? But anyway guys, uh, if you enjoyed this video, please leave a like on the video. Definitely subscribe to the channel. And Jay Solo, thank you so much for making this possible. With that being said, thank you so much for watching Goonies. And I am out of here.